everyone and welcome to another open studio video with me Elisa Ray. Since the last time I did this, spring has sprung. And behind me can you see there's some jasmine flowers so they are really good smells in the air and I hope that you are all enjoying the warmer weather. Spring is a time of renewal and of hope so I thought that our check-in for today can be, you need to maybe Google this or maybe you can ask a friend or your parents or your brothers or sisters for an inspirational saying. So, or maybe you have one of these. This book is called Inspirational Meditations. And I'm randomly going to choose, that means I'm just going to pick any spot in this book and I'm going to show you a picture and we'll see what it says. Okay, so... So bright yellow for courage. So it says, courage is the discovery that you may not win and trying when you know you can lose and that was said by Tom Krauser so that's something to think about our project for today it's called a paper twirl and it's something you can hang by a window and you can write a motivational quote and do some nice art so I'm going to take you through the process of how to make a paper twirl to begin with, you're going to need an A4 page, which you're going to fold in half. You're going to need something round to trace around, so this is quite a useful plastic lid I've got. Pencil and scissors. So I'm going to quickly show you what I've done with those things. Okay, so I'm going to take the lid and I'm going to trace around the lid on my page that's folded in half. And I'm going to get a circle like that. Then I'm going to cut through both of those papers, which is going to give me, should give me, two circles that are exactly the same size. Okay, there we go. And then I'm going to fold them in half. Okay, so there's my circles with a fold. And then what I'm going to do is take a stapler. And I'm going to make two staples near the top and one near the bottom. And what you're going to get is a paper structure that looks like this. So now you have all these sides on the paper where you can do spring decorations and write motivations. Okay, so I've written that quote from our check-in. And I'm just decorating the page with some spring flowers. And then I think on one of the other sides of this paper twirl, I'm going to swap to oil pastels and just do some art. So I'll show you what that looks like in a moment. Okay, so these are oil pastels that you see here and they're quite nice if you want to use color that's got that's quite a deep color and that you can fill your page up quite quickly so 
I'm going to cover all of this, all of these two pages with oil pastel. I'll show you what it looks like when it's finished. Hi, so this is my completed paper twirl with some artwork and some messages. So the last part of what you're going to do, you're going to find the hole in between the two staples here and you're going to thread some string in between those two staples so that you can hang your paper twirl up. So I'm going to cut off some string. And push it through there and voila, there we go. There's your spring paper twirl. If you hang it up near a window, then it will turn nicely and then you can inspire people with your messages. So our check out for today is me reading you the next message that I found in that same book. And it says that simplicity is making the journey of this life with just baggage enough. And that was by Anonymous. So enjoy the spring and till next time, bye for me. Thank you for joining our online open studio. We hope to see you again soon. Please remember to send us your artwork and creations. You can post it to any of our social media sites and tag us or send us an email. Open Studio is supported by the Mary Oppenheimer and Daughters Foundation and Rand Merchant Bank.